Hello, welcome back to the Sheila Ray Screechers. I'm Sam and this is Max. This is Tucker, our yeah. special guest. And we have two more special guests today. Say hello. Hi, I'm Bo. <laughs> and I'm Maddie. <laughs> yeah, a lot going Sheila Ray. <laughs> and today we're gonna talk about pollution. Yes, yeah. it's very harmful for the earth. It's, it's what, pollution is one of the things that causes global warming. Hey, right Daddy. now, Sammy's Come getting on, on his ITV stuff let's to let's show us the pollution. Let's talk to a little global warming. Smoke comes out from the muffler and pollutes the air and, with smoke. And this carbon is, dioxide. And this carbon, is carbon dioxide. Pollution. Yes, it's plastic, Tucker. Yeah, plastic pollutes the ton. Yeah. Plus, this well, is when pollution. they make the plastic. Yeah. 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 And then and when plus the plastic smoke, and this smoke is, is a big thing for pollution. It's actually not the smoke, it's carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide. Yeah, carbon dioxide. Yeah. And compost or food scraps that you put in the landfill are a huge producer of methane. Yeah, methane. A it's gas even stronger worse. than carbon dioxide rah, rah, that warms up our atmosphere rah. quicker. And now yeah. we will show you one more special guest and I will film. Belle, come on, <gasps> Belle. This right, is right, Belle. Belle. And she's part of the Rice family. Come the Rice family Belle came along by Tuck. The Rice family came all the way from Connecticut to be with us. Tucker is in the Rice family too. Oh, yep, yeah. right here. I'm Tucker. Tucker. I'm right there. Don't and you can that. tell that he's not very happy about it apparently. And you can tell that yeah. he's a totally a Yankee player. Yeah, he I'm likes the Red Yankees. I like the Red Sox. What? Me yes. too! These are pollution. Right now, Oops. Belle's gonna get the camera again. And over I here is. Over here is a solution to global warming, kind of. Up here. Yeah. yeah so the Belle, the show the sun of the. I know. Up there. Solar panels. Which help yeah. power your house. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, get all these keys for me. Yeah. They're free. But don't lose mm -hmm. them for the ATV. And, and, and Sammy, remember your part? Uh-huh. Remember what you say? And then we can, um, we can get the, um, we, the electricity gets sent out to the street and we get a little bit of what, Max? Money! Money. You like money? <laughs> and what we're going to show you now um, helps a little bit with um, with a solution to global warming. It's called a compost bin, and it's right here where Bo is. And what a compost bin does is you put food in it and it it gets it composted into it. no it gets composted into dirt. Actually wait. And so we put it in our garden and it cuts down on methane. It disintegrates into dirt. It does. It does disintegrate by itself. It has help from the environment. Yes, like it has help from the environment. They like the eat, worm. They eat food scraps and they poop dirt. They do. <laughs> Great explanation, Max. Max, such a wonderful explanation. Oh, oh guess what? Oh, a bug will poop. <laughs> oh, plus yeah, poop it looks lies. like Bo's going poop. <laughs> hey, 
fruit and try to like, too. Hey man, hey, you can eat uh, fruit. a pumpkin. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, so these are many great reasons, like about how to solve pollution and how to not ruin our earth with pollution. The carbon dioxide goes up there. Into the and sky. It makes our sky like a greenhouse. When the sun shines down onto the earth, it creates heat. It, and it then it down. can't uh -huh. go out of our atmosphere, so it stays in our world and warms it up. Well, it breaks bad. down, and it doesn't necessarily warm it up. It's climate change. It just it just doesn't do global warming. Um, and when it does, well, all the um, carbon dioxide and all the bad chemicals and stuff that we that go into the air from like everything, like cars and stuff like that, it breaks down the layer in our atmosphere that protects us from um, solar radiation. And so it. When it does that, then more solar radiation get in, gets into our Earth, and it can't get back out, and so it um, causes climate change. Yep. <laughs> and now Belle's saying bye. Bye, Belle. It is freezing out here. Goodbye. <laughs> well, a good thing it's freezing because that means climate change okay. isn't no. that like. That's well, not true. Well, it means climate change like doesn't happen extremely quickly. And I guess that's the end of our pollution episode. Wait, 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 See wait. See you wait. next episode. Wait. What Max else? has more stuff. Well, no, no, no. so climate change is still happening. 50 it is. Million, yeah. 50 million years ago. How it was it was it was super hot. But back then there were no people. So so you're wondering how it got so hot? Well, industrialization. Yep. Volcanoes, when they erupt, <laughs> they produce carbon dioxide <laughs> into the atmosphere. So Matthew, that you hold it. Well, it's not. It's not the volcanoes. It's um. That's what happened way back when. But now, um, in like Wanna go over this to the marsh? age of time, <laughs> these last there. centuries. It's been because of industrialization, which has greatly increased the climate change. Yes. Yeah. Do you want to like show them this? It's like a turtle race. So sometimes the warming turtle and the coin turtle crash each other, but they, they end up up evening it up at the finish line. But uh, it's like, but with global warming, it's like we put like the warming or turtle on a jet-powered roll. Roller skate or something. And that is coffee, right, Max? Except it doesn't always make everything warm. It also makes it full because what it does is it melts um, so, all the ice in like the diff different poles, which then makes the water um, more would have there be more water. Which well, can yeah. Cause things to that, be warmer uh, or colder. Sammy, do you want to? Sh Let's go show them the rainbow. We don't need to. Into a tree and then Blue. By the way, yeah. we got those, we got, us, I got the idea from the Tori Tudor and the Warming Turtle for, from another good podcast called Wow in the World by Guy Raz and Minty. So now it's not copyright. There are, there are many ways that we can help um, our Earth. reduce this climate change. Let's yes. start with not not really polluting the air by not throwing recycling in into the water or ocean, which then it can cause turtles to get... Um, save yeah. the turtles! And save I, the turtles. Save the turtles. <laughs> Hydro flask. If, 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 and, and then if the... You draw, no, no. And, uh, if you draw trash in the water... All right, this is modern entertainment 2.0 right here. Let <laughs> we'll get trash. For example, when a well, soda we can start by reducing the use of our cars because those have pollution, which can cause climate change. Yeah, and try riding your bikes a bit more. Yeah, or using public transportation, which reduces the amount of cars that we have on the road. Like school buses and stuff. Because eh, imagine or and a, a couple school, school buses still school and uh, we need maximum. School bus school buses still pollute, but they pollute less. Than, than every single human being. 
family that's probably, driving their kids to That's exactly. probably because they go slower. Or you can bike, yeah. or you can walk, no, because and a, you can use reusable can shopping bags. For example, uh, we're right by our school. It's just up the road. So we can walk or bike anytime to put to yeah. stop like driving. Yeah. yeah. And um, also, we can use reusable shopping bags, which reduces the amount of um, yeah. plastic. Yeah. Which we also do. We which um, in Connecticut yeah. we have a ten pers a ten cent um, cost for every plastic bag that you use. So a lot of people have started using reusable bags, which is great. Um, yeah, that's great. Or we can use compostable stuff or stuff made out of recycled materials to reduce the amount of plastic that we have in our own world. And Maddie's in high school, so she knows this stuff. Yeah, and my phone case is actually made out of recyclable, recyclable materials. That's good. And it's also compostable, so it's good for our environment. That's very good. If and only everything. Of some of the funds that I spent on this um, phone case is those two helping turtles in the wildlife. Well, that's really good. Yeah. If only everything was like that. Yeah. yeah. What is so all that? Like, there's actually this green invention. Save it's, the earth. No, it's it's for saving the turtles. Yeah. Turtles or any animal. Save the turtles. Packs. So you know your six pack that holds your can, can your beers, Gatorade, your, your Gatorade. beer together and can oh, your and Gatorade. And yeah, all that, that gets stuck on Tortoise's neck. And, and, and that kills them. Kill them. So they can every also time, eat it and think it's food. If yeah, it's in and the that ocean. will kill them. Every too. yeah. Every time you throw something in the water or a litter, like a um, you risk like killing a, a turtle or something. That's killing turtle. Yeah. Yeah. And Which is yeah. horrible. But and this gun will get that. Fun fact. Everybody. Yeah. You may that. think you're yeah. recycling when you put all your recyclables into the recycling bins. But By guess way, what? Most of the time, all that recycling ends up going right back into your trash. I know it's sad, but do I know here why? It's because the they don't people the don't clean them out. Don't feel like paying extra to have all those. Recyclable materials cleaned out because people don't wash them. Yes, so wash your so wash things. So recyclables, and then your recyclables will actually get recycled. Yeah. Yeah, that's what we always that's do. That's why I lick the peanut well, butter jar clean. Yeah, good idea, then, Belle. Well, or wash it out. Like, yeah. At least two times. Yeah, just wash it out. You don't need to lick the peanut butter jar clean, Belle. Yeah, wait. That was wait, by the way. Hey, so this. This, there were, there's a beer company that worked, worked and they invented a turtle food six pack. It's it's a six pack that's edible to turtles. That's smart. Yep. So oh if you if so oh you're actually, so you're not harming the turtles at all if you chuck one of those six packs into the water. Yes. You're just giving them food. We could talk about pollution forever. Yeah. But we don't have a. Uh, we don't have a huge memory card on this thing. So, I guess this concludes our episode. Bye! Bye. Rankies rule!